Hello scientific writers. In this video we're going to talk about careers in scientific writing. So there's probably a few of you out there that are like me who actually enjoy scientific writing and maybe you enjoy it more than you enjoy doing your research and you want to see if maybe there's a career for you using your scientific writing skills and interests. And there is. In fact there are a lot of careers for you if you like scientific writing especially if you have an advanced degree that's going to help a lot so what we'll do today is look at some current job openings for scientific writers and related careers using scientific writing skills well, let's get started let's start with searching Glassdoor for scientific writer in the United States Glassdoor provides salary estimates and so we can get an idea of the salaries now how accurate these salaries are, I can't really say, but they are a good starting point. We see here that there are 602 jobs that are being advertised as of today, which is November 29th, 2021. And they give some salary estimates. They estimate that the average base pay for scientific writer is about $71,000. Let's click here on more insights and see what comes up. Okay, so here's the salary distribution on the low end. They show 50,000 on the high end. They show 100,000. Now I happen to know that that is an underestimate. There are a lot of jobs that are much higher than 100,000 for scientific writers. Well, let's go over here and look at the overview of the job. Uh, and it says, what does a scientific writer do? And then the first sentence changes terms. It says medical writer. So they've completely dropped the term scientific writer and they've switched to the term medical writer. Medical writers are the unifiers between scientific medical knowledge and written communication for various institutions, including hospitals, academic medical centers, or pharmaceutical companies. They often follow one of two paths, scientific medical writing or non-scientific or marketing medical writing. Medical writers translate drug trials and medical study findings, as well as clinical data, to put into presentations to regulatory documents and for medical journal abstracts that are distributed to a professional audience. All right, I think that's a reasonably good summary of the job except I wouldn't limit it to medical journal abstracts. There are medical writers that write the entire journal article along with the scientists who performed the work. If we scroll down this page, we see the scientific writer career path, average years of experience. The highest category is two to four years. That's got 58% of, and this is not including years spent in education or training. So this is post-graduation. So let's go back to this entry page and look at some of the 602 jobs. We have a technical writing manager, a medical writer, a remote senior medical writer, medical writer, junior scientific writer, medical communications and publications manager, protocol development specialist in parentheses medical slash scientific writer, a scientific technical writer, a medical writer of technical reports, technical writer, senior medical writer, this one is a regulatory scientific writer, level two, medical writer of medical communications, analytical scientific tech writer, scientific writer at University of Washington, lead scientific writer for vaccines at GSK, and a senior writer scientific at Tulane University. Quite a few titles here. So here's one from EPM Scientific. They're Employer provided salary is $90 to $100 per hour. A master's or a PhD is preferred. A minimum of three years of medical writing with experience of IND and marketing application submissions. So IND is investigational new drug. This is an FDA document, so it's a regulatory document. They want the person to have knowledge of publicly available databases such as PubMed, DailyMed, FDA, and EMA sources and guidelines for literature and information mining to support document content and citing such information appropriately. And it does have benefits of 401k and health insurance. Let's look at another one. This is Junior Scientific Writer from Amador Biosciences. 
They say the junior scientific writer is responsible for technical writing and prepare documents in accordance with AMA SOPs and Manual of Style. So that's the American Medical Association Standard Operating Procedures and the AMA Manual of Style. It can be remote or in person. A lot of these scientific writer jobs are remote. So if you like working remotely, you don't want to commute to some office, then this is a great option for you. Uh, the key responsibilities are prepare, review, revise, and maintain SOPs and other documents, suggest and implement improvements to the shared documentation repository, responsible for writing, formatting, editing, reviewing, proofing technical reports, and publishing documents in Adobe, the ability to apply styles, assist in creating in-depth training guides, comply with Amador internal processes and procedures. So this job requires a lot of attention to detail, complying with formatting and other requirements. So the person is going to be some someone who's very detail oriented. They look for a minimum two years scientific medical writing experience, life science or medical academic background, which is a little surprising because junior scientific writer sounds like it should be a like a zero years experience detailed knowledge of ICH guidelines, good understanding of medical scientific terminology, and experience in data analysis and interpretation. All right, this one is uh, medical communications and publications. In the description here, it says the pay rate is $100,000 base salary. What you'll do is conduct literature review for at-home collection methods and testing opportunities, utilize research to create data-driven medical content or publications, develop medical education that can be used pre-purchase or post results, ensure content aligns with customer or physician needs, maintain scientific and clinical accuracy, able to work effectively on multiple projects, participate in lead content review, serve as a liaison between the medical affairs and clinical science teams, and direct the planning and execution of medical and scientific publications, and ensure publications adhere to policies and procedures, SOPs, and meet the industry standards. How about qualifications? Three to five years experience in clinical research and or pharmaceuticals as a medical writer, minimum of a bachelor's degree, but an advanced degree, MS or PhD is strongly preferred, this is from Paracel, and it's a senior medical writer. The Glassdoor estimate of the salary is seventy-five to one hundred and seventy-five thousand. Let's scroll down and read some details here. As a senior medical writer with Paracel, you will research, create, and edit all documents associated with clinical research. Responsibilities include lead author and primary client contact for medical writing projects working with other Paracel departments and clients to set and meet internal external deliverable timelines, project leadership, and training and support of junior medical writing staff. For education, they are looking for a bachelor's degree in life sciences or health related sciences or equivalent, but they do not list the number of years of experience that is expected. All right, let's look at one from a university. Here's one from the University of Washington in Seattle. This is called the Scientific Writer, and the estimate by Glassdoor is 45 to 92,000. They are assuming that the base salary is going to be about $64,000. So this is going to be substantially less than a lot of the companies will pay medical writers or scientific writers. But if you'd prefer to work at a university, maybe you're willing to accept lower pay for that trade-off. They have an outstanding opportunity for a scientific writer position in the scientific publications team. The primary purpose of this position is to support the development of high quality peer-reviewed scientific papers. The individual will write and coordinate the production of polished papers in collaboration with researchers for submission to peer-reviewed journals. If you like writing journal articles, this would be a great job for you. You don't have to know about FDA requirements or all, all those other regulatory kinds of things because you're not going to be writing regulatory documents. You're going to be writing journal articles. The requirement is a bachelor's degree and five years of experience or equivalent combination of education and experience. But they do prefer a master's or PhD 
degree in health sciences or a related field. Okay, so we've looked at the first page of scientific writer. Let's do another search. We're going to search medical writer. Now for medical writer, we see that there were 565 jobs that came up. The average base pay is $85,000. And it's ranging from 60 to 121,000. So the overview paragraph for medical writer is the exact same paragraph that they put for scientific writer, uh, but the pay is higher. So when you search medical writer, you're going to get a set of jobs that highly overlaps with the set of jobs you would get when you search scientific writer. But that subset has a higher salary range. Now that we've looked at several of the current openings for scientific or medical writers, what is the career outlook for the medical writing field? Let's take a look at this preview of a market report from Business Market Insights from just a few days ago. And they say that the North America medical writing market is expected to witness rapid growth by 2027, so over the next five years. If we look at more detail, they say the medical writing market is expected to reach 1.26 billion five years from now, up from 733 million in 2019. The market is estimated to grow with a compounding annual growth rate of 7.1% over this time period. So that's a pretty rapid expansion in the market. And so there's going to be a demand for new employees or new medical writers to fulfill that demand. This report also says, the demand for medical writing is on the rise on account of increasing drugs, biomedical, and other pharmaceutical product launches. In this report, they break down the North American medical writing market into clinical writing, regulatory writing, scientific writing, and others as applied to medical journalism, medical education, medical marketing, and others. And the consumers of this market would be pharmaceutical and biotech companies, contract research organizations, or CROs, and others, including hospitals and universities. If you'd like more information about careers in scientific writing, I'm going to have another video or two describing some additional aspects of the careers. So be on the lookout for those. Consider subscribing to the Scientific Writing School YouTube channel for more videos on scientific writing related topics. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time and happy writing.